With the holiday school break coming up, you might be scrambling for ways to keep your kids busy and entertained. Well, here's an idea. Send them to the kitchen. Day Day Wilson from Bakerpedia.com is here with her assistant, Kian, and he's going to show us some interesting things we can do with the entire family. I love this idea. Well, you know, the kids are about to come home on school break, and this is all about, it's about baking, but it's about creativity and DIY. And look at the color that we have in front of us. This looks so much fun. Look at this cake. We are going to make this cake. What we have here is white batter dyed in all of Kian's favorite colors. You can dye whatever color you want. And we're going to assemble the different colored batters in this pan. And you know what? Just start scooping and plopping, Kian. Kian, can you have you do done that? a lot of baking before? No. Not but so he's much. He's going to do some today. The thing about this, JD, is yeah. that there's no way to do it wrong. This is just about getting in there and playing with color. And you're going to get, you want to have um, the different colors. Uh. You don't want to put similar colors uh. next to each other. Did you say, uh? <laughs> I heard an, uh. He's done with the green. He's done with the green. He's going in for a different color. Look at us. We're like crisscrossing here. Now, we you totally want to use uh, these vibrant colors are made with gel food coloring. We've really? Got a Where do you get? Right oh, here. I see it right there. You can find them at craft stores, some supermarkets, but usually you're going to have to go to a craft store or a cake decorating store, mm -hmm. and they just have the vivid, vivid colors. So, okay, let me. We would keep. We would keep doing this. Well, why right? wouldn't we? Yeah. It's well, it's fine. okay. All right. All right. No all right. good. We, we got to get right, some so, decoration. So, well, let me so just show you So we keep doing it, but think. how do we get this? I mean, that's an amazing pattern. Right. So once we get all of our batter yeah. in here, right there. you just take uh -huh. a simple butter knife, and you would <gasps> swirl, 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 and that's it. And then that goes in the oven, and when it's baked, it's going to look like this. Turned upside down. I mean, this is sort of interesting because it's showing us the pattern. Right. But look at that cross section. The inside cross section is absolutely really cool. So really cool. But now, how are we going to decorate it? So this is, a good this is kind of like the inside has just that wow factor. But look at the top. Now, this I know you guys yeah. know because you guys helped me with this before. We this is fondant. This is an edible sugar dough. Right. It's kind of like a clay. Mm -hmm. Kian rolled those out, and then these drawings were made with edible markers. Now, one of Kian did one of these. All right, and I did one. Can you tell? Can you tell who did which? Because I have the artistic skills of an elementary school. I gotta say, this with the nature, and we got the the the. I don't know the birds. I'm kind of grooving on that. That well, you're grooving on Kian's because that was his. So well I think done. you guys have to sign your work. We do. So show us how easy this is to use. So these are edible markers. Wherever you find you go, the gel colors, you're going to be able to find these markers too. And these are easy. Look at that. Look at I that. love it. I love it. And for a birthday, you could write happy birthday. Mm -hmm. You could draw a tableau. So JD kind of went with like the Christmas theme. Kian, is that your house? Yeah. Which is your room? You upstairs or downstairs? Up. Way up, up top? Way up top. He's at the. He told me his mom calls him King Kian. Is this, it says you're King Kian. He's at the top. King. There Kian. you go. And then so we have these our are simply put on the frosting. We've got the recipe for the cake and the frosting and all of this online. You would just lay your beautiful little uh, drawn tableau on top of your cake, and when you cut into it, it looks like this. It's going to blow people away. Kian, the best part of doing kitchen segments on the Better Show is that we get to taste food. Do you want to take a bite of this cake? Sure. Or try the frosting? Yeah. Sure. I mean, like, what's okay, the point of coming all the way to the kitchen if you don't get to try the cake, right? Here you go. That's there you your go. piece. There you go. Buddy. Oh, look at that. And look you at break that. it open. What do you think? It looks. Here we go. The moment of truth. <laughs> and do you approve? Now, yes. here's another fun thing we can do in the kitchen on the Better Show. You can take a hunk of cake. You can dip it in the oh, batter. Oh man. The frosting you batter. JD. Uh huh. I <laughs> got. <laughs> that's fantastic. I'm more of a frosting person, but really, I like the batter. It's you know, absolutely that's delicious. That's okay. It's all about having fun, right? It totally is. I so. love these creations. These are fantastic. You can go to our website at bettertv.com to get this recipe and find more great Bakerpedia tips. Keep going. Lots of fun things that you can do with your kids during the holidays. Get them involved in the baking, and you know they will get involved in the eating. <laughs>